All right, this is a very startling story. It's a warning for pregnant women. A new study links plastic bottles to obesity in our unborn babies. Prenatal exposure to the chemical BPA found in cans and water bottles, it can lead to higher risks of obesity. And get this, 94% of women in the Columbia University study had BPA exposure and had children with increased measures of body fat. All right, so what do you need to know to avoid this toxin? We're going to ask our Fox News Medical A team doctor, Dr. David Samadhi. Good Thanks morning. for being with us, Dr. Samadhi. All right, so first of all, what is BPA for people who are watching and aren't familiar with it? BPA is basically stands for bisphenol A. It's basically all over our life. You see it in the receipt papers, it's in the bottled uh, water, and it's also in the lining of all of these canned food and soup. It's everywhere. Now, why is it important? Childhood obesity is on the rise. You can see the list of all the products right. that you can find this. Childhood <clears throat> obesity is on the rise. And we kept talking about put your children for exercise and stay away from sugar. Fat fat and sugar and everything. But this is a secret that's kind of like behind the scene that's sneaking up on us. And you are drinking it. In this particular study, Brian, they look at all the prenatal and pregnant women. They follow the about 369 of them. And they find that if you have a high urine amount of bisphenol a, your children by the age of three and seven, they're going to be obese. And this is a really strong association we want people to know. What are they thinking putting it in there, and how do we avoid using it? Well, the reason why it stays is because, you know, the product can last longer. It has a higher sh uh, shelf life, and so it's great for them, but not good for us. In adults, obviously, it's been associated with diabetes, with asthma, and many kinds of cancers such as breast what cancer. Do they this is this? a serious problem. So how do you avoid it? Stay, first of all, look at the labels, and you should be taking Taking bisphenol or BPA free products, stick to these uh, glasses. Uh, drink from glasses, stay away from these microwaves in these plastics because the lining can really break down and you can get BPA in your food and just reduce on your canned food. That's really the big message to a lot of pregnant is, women and, and all of us. Is BPA linked to any diseases? Well, I think that a lot, in, in men we see that it's endocrine disruptors. It can affect your testosterone, it can affect your thyroids, it can cause diabetes. These are all associations, but certainly many cancers can also but lead but from this. But we should react to this the way we felt we react to asbestos. It's got to stop right away. So from today on, we're going to have a whole new mission, starting with Brian, to go after BPA. If it can, re I'm serious about this. I, I, if it can too. reduce, look at this. 94% of those people had kids that are obese. So you, you have to. We have to break real this. Real quickly, if you're a pregnant woman, drink your water from from the faucet. From the glass. From the glass. Stay from microwaving these products. Look at the products. Make sure they're BPA okay. free. Okay. I'll do that. And watch your kids. Make sure they're. I'm going to go back to the hose, like my after my wiffle ball games. It seemed to work. Uh, that it was safe for them. No, this is a serious. Yeah. I know. I'm Absolutely. back to the hose. Hi. Let's, let's put uh, uh, pressure on the it. companies to reduce this BPA. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thanks, Dr. Samadhi. Thank you. Thank you, Brian.